princess. How could you commit your future to that wretched thing? Huh? What kind of plans do you have for yourself? I thought you were bigger than this. Why that peasant? Collins. You can call me whatever you so please. I do not care. But I beg of you. Do not insult Michael. For you do not know a damn thing about him. You don't. I do not need eternity to know that you have no future with him. Why are you bothered? The future we are talking about here is mine and not yours. So it's best you mind your business and stay off mine. Excuse me. Jane. Stubbornness will do you no good. Stay away from that nigger for your own good. You have a nice day. Welcome. What do you want? Are you Michael? No. Where is Michael? He's not around. Tell him the king wants to see him at the palace immediately. Okay. Good. You are once a loving father. All the love and care you gave me. What happened to you? What happened to you? My offense is asking to be with the one I love. Then you turn your back on me. What happened to you? What happened to you? Papa, what happened to the care that you show me? And the love that we share. What happened to you? What happened to you? Daddy, what happens to the care that you show me and the love that we share? What happened to you? What happened to you? It's like I'm lost. I don't get it anymore. Someone tell me what's going on. It feels like I am getting drowned. You are once a loving father All the love and care you gave me What happened to you? What happened to you? My offense is asking to be with the one I love Then you turn your back on me What happened to you? What happened to you? Papa, what happened to the care that you show me and the love that we share? What happened to you? What happened to you? Daddy, what happened to the care that you show me and the love that we share? Greetings, Your Majesty. What happened to you? What happened to you? Are you aware that my daughter is disobeying me for the first time because of you? I'm very sorry, sir. Very sorry. If you truly are, then terminate your engagement. 
engagement, denounce your relationship and return my daughter home. You won't do that? Tell me what you want. I can meet you halfway if I can't fully. But I want you to stay away from my daughter. With due respect, sir. I did not get involved with your daughter because of your money or your status. I love her. If you truly love her, then you must stay away from her. She's still a medical student and I want her to get the best result. I want her to become the best physician this country has ever produced. She won't be able to do that with your presence around her. I haven't said you may not love my daughter. You can be friends, best of friends as a matter of fact. But you must remember that she is a medical student. A medical student and I want her to pass with the best grades. I want her to emerge as the best physician this country has ever produced. Is that hard to understand? Please, sir. I. Young man, I am not always friendly with strangers. In fact, I can be ruthless. Now, mark these words. I will never let anything come between my daughter and her education. Do I make myself clear? Do I? Yes, Your Majesty. Get out! Thank you, Your Majesty. You are once a loving father. All the love and care you gave me. What happened to you? What happened to you? My offense is asking to be with the one I love. Then you turn your back on me What happened to you? What happened to you? Papa, what happened to the care that you showed me And the love that we share? What happened to you? What happened to you? Daddy, what happened to the care that you showed me and the love that we share What happened to you? What happened to you? It's like I'm lost I don't get it anymore Someone tell me what's going on It feels like I am getting drowned You are once a loving father 
All the love and care you gave me, what happened to you? I don't get money where I go to play my bet. The word is. Go and move your hand, Chris. I will see. I will see. Take her from here. I will see with you. Oh. Huh? We could share this. Share the share money with equal. It. Share with you. Share and give all share of us. Oh, wow. Idiot. But wait, too. Why are you this lucky? Do that day this man came, he gave you money. Hmm? Today again, he gave you money. Are you the only one in this compound? Yes. Now let me date this compound. See yourself. Your head not get oil. You know what I say? My head get oil. My second name now lucky. If you don't know. Eh. Hey. This uh, what get to be a gamma lizard. Now you talk say my man not born picky, Abi. Good. You see yourself? Since when I small, now I take get luck. Don't worry. When I could use this thing, then knock the bet, eh? <laughs> 97 mil. 97 million I go get. When I get a man, all of them I go come, they serve me here because I go be your God majesty for my kingdom. See yourself? Idiot. So you have money to come out from here before come I... Yeah, give us our share. I'm going to use it and play bets. Give Abby. us our share. I tell you, you know, I tell you, who share? You take that one give me. Mona! I will. Look at both my numbers. I will. I will. I will. I will. Get out of here! Get out of here! Don't worry. See this scarecrow, you see the talk? So they don't worry you. They're just. No, come on, let me see you. You are once a loving father. Oh, no. I do not understand. Hey, shut up. I'll listen up. I have no time with you. Are you aware of the gravity of the damage you are about to inflict into Jane's life? And what the hell are you doing with Jane? Tell me. Oh, you got nerves. Uh -huh. I see. <laughs> I hope you will be able to stand me when the time comes. Hmm? I do not know how you got into her life, but I want you to know that I have known her for years. Did you get it? And I know the relationship she shares with her family and that bond is what you are about to destroy, but I will not allow you. Did you get that? I'm not scared of you. You cannot warn me. I'm not afraid of anybody. I see. Who are you? I see. Be careful. Jane is my woman. I will not allow you to trade in our line. Did you get what I said? Stay clear from her. If you have any feeling for Jane, just tell her to go back to her family and stay away from her. I will not warn you again. Stay away from her. Jane, I think you should reconsider this your engagement with Michael. Why would you say a thing like that? You know how much I love Michael. I know, and I am not disputing that fact. But don't you think of the damage it will do to the cordial relationship you have with your father? But it's my father's fault. What would you have me do? My father doesn't care about any other person but himself. He's so inconsiderate about my wishes and demand. And I don't like that. I want to be free from his influence. Oluchi, I am a princess. But people hardly know that I am. That is my life. I just want to be free. A free life devoid of his control and imposition of views. I mean, is that too much for me to ask? Jane, this is not about you and your father. It has to do with other people. Okay. Today, I saw Collins confronting Michael because of you. And you know how dangerous that guy can be. Right now, I think Michael's life might be in danger. What? Yes. What? What did you just say? Baby. Why did you confront my fiance? Oh. 
I told you that. Come on, that dude is incredible. Answer my question. Why did you have to confront my fiance? For what reason? Well, uh, I... Baby... Okay. Don't touch him. Do not. Okay. I did not beat him. I just had a man-to-man -man chat with him. Come on, it's not a big deal, okay? Did he actually tell you that? No, he didn't. You know why? Because he's a gentleman. A gentleman that sorts his way out without talking too much. But that doesn't make him too soft as you think. Mm. That sounds impressive. Leave us alone. Leave us be. I mean, what is wrong with you? I've told you times with that number that I am engaged to this man. I love him. He's going to be my husband. Let us be. No. Did you hear what I said? I said no. I will not allow him marry you. I will stop that from happening. Mm -hmm. Did you get it? Yes. I love you. And I cannot stand to contest anyone coming close to you. Not even a nameless thing. Nameless, you say? Mm hmm <laughs> Well, it's very, very easy for you to say because you think you have achieved a lot for yourself. You are nobody, Collins. What are you? I mean, what do you think you are outside Senator Ken's dynasty? Absolutely nothing. What pride and prestige have you outside your father's success? Apart from this thing, this thing you call a boutique. What else do you think you have? Hey, 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 I, I am here to warn you for the very last time. Stay away from us. Stay away from my relationship. Stay away from my life. Leave us be, for crying out loud. I am taken. Get that into your head. Please. Did you say that to me? You said that to me, right? I will show him how to dance the music. You are once a loving father. All the love and care you gave me. What happened to you? What happened to you? My offense is asking to be with the one I love. Then you turn your back on me. What happened to you? What happened to you? Papa, what happened to the care that you showed me? And the love that we share? What happened to you? What happened to you? Daddy, what happened to the care that you showed me? And the love that we share? What happened to you? What happened to you? It's like I'm lost. I don't get it anymore. Someone tell me what's going on. It feels like I am getting drowned. You are once a loving father. All the love and care you gave me. What happened to you? What happened to you? My offense is asking to be with the one I love. Then you turn your back on me. What happened to you? What happened to you? Papa, what happened to the care that you showed me? And the love that we share. What happened to you? What happened to you? Daddy, what happened to the kid? I 
Hello, bro. Ah, uh, Kenne. How are you? I am fine. I'm alright. Are you? Okay, what of Jane? Jane? Not at all. She's not been here since she left with you. Hope all is well. Um, yes, yes, all is well, all is well. Uh, actually, she stepped out of the house a couple of hours ago and I even thought she'll be with you guys. No, she's not here. Okay, maybe she'll stop by to see a friend. All right, later then. Bye. Is Jane with you? Oh, no, no, no. I haven't seen her today. Hey. Hey, what's going on? I've been calling her. I've not been able to reach her. Oh my God, what's going on? What's going on? Michael, calm down. What's wrong? I don't know. I don't know. She called me around 5 p.m. and said she was leaving school. And she'll be back in about 30 minutes. It's past 8 now. I've not seen her. I don't know where she is. Did you try to find out if she went to her family's house? Oh yes, I, I spoke with Kenne a few minutes ago. Kenne said she, she's not at home. Hey, Oluji, I'm scared, I'm scared. This is serious. Did you guys fight? No, we did not fight. I told you she called me. Everything is okay. She called me by 5 p.m. Said she was coming back. I've not seen her. <sighs> <sighs> This is serious. Um, okay, um, Michael, you know what? Just calm down. Calm down, okay? Jane, okay, I, I believe she should be somewhere and I think she's okay wherever she is right now. So, just relax your mind. Okay? Don't get yourself worked up, please. Just relax your mind. Hey, all right, all right, fine, fine. Thank you. Huh? Alpha. Uh, hey, I was even calling to know if she came back to uh, you people's place. She's not here. She's not back. Oh, oh my God, I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. But I, I believe she's fine wherever she is. Okay, she's fine. See, for now, don't say anything to anybody. Okay, I'll step out right now and go and start searching for her. I'll search everywhere, anywhere at all I can think of. I'll start from her school. It's possible she spent the night in a friend's place. Huh? Don't panic. I believe she'll be fine. I will, I will, don't worry. I'm leaving right now. What is going on? My queen, I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know how to say this, but I think Jane is missing. No, no, I don't, I don't understand. How do you mean by Jane is missing? Last time, last time I spoke with her was yesterday. 
She called me and said she was coming back home at around 5 p.m. From that time till now, I've not seen her. I've been calling her, her phone is switched off. I don't, in fact, I've even gone to all the places that she goes to. I've called her friends. No sign of her. I don't know what to do. about where is my daughter where is my daughter no my queen that's why i'm here ha. yeah ha. Oh. what am i hearing here oh. what am i hearing huh? eh? what am i hearing you to say, talk about where's my daughter are you now deaf and dumb now listen i'm going to Carve you into two, slice you into two, then slice off your head. Now, my friend, will you come out? Come out here. Where are you going to? Where is my daughter? What is happening? What is happening? No, just to calm down. Just calm down. How can I calm down? We are talking about my daughter here. You don't know where your daughter is. This young man does not know where my daughter is. Where is my daughter? Where is my daughter? Where? Calm down. What? What are you telling me? Calm down. How? Look at this one. It's not saying anything. Now, I'm asking for my daughter. I'm asking for my daughter. Why is everybody not talking? I'm talking about your own sister. And where is the other boy? What are you doing here? Go, 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 go. Michael, what do we do? How do we find Jane? No, no. I can't you didn't ask me now, did you ask me? We're talking about Jane, it's not Igwe here, please. Where is he? Where, where can we find her? Also, where we, I didn't tell you Igwe was around. Where do we find Jane? I do know two I one mother and one Igwe now. Scream, no one here will ever hear you. Do I make myself clear? Shh, easy. Okay, easy, easy, easy. Okay. Eat. Eat. What have I done to you people? Why are you doing this to me? Why have you helped me here? Who sent you? Hey! No question. Eat! I'm not hungry. And that will be your headache. Because we're doing just as instructed. Okay? Instructed? By who, please? Eat! Don't hear me what I said. No question. Eat! I'm not hungry. If you don't want to chop, come on, chop that food. What's wrong with you? I'm not hungry. I want to go. You want to go? Go ahead and eat your food. <laughs> Please let me go. Any more words from this room? <laughs> Please let me go. What really happened? Did you guys fight? No. We didn't fight. 
I've known Jane for uh, some time now. I, I love her. We've not had any issues. She called me yesterday around 5 p.m. and said she was coming back home. Since then, I've not heard from her till now. Did you have any issue with anybody you believe might be behind this? No. Oh, I've been thinking. You know, I'm a very peaceful person. You know, I've just been thinking. No, I've been asking myself, where could she be? I've checked all the places that she could have gone to. I've not seen her. I'm, I'm so confused and scared. You should have just listened when Daddy asked you to stay away from Jane. But come to think of it, how did you even think you can marry a girl against her father's will? You don't have my father's support, neither do you have mine. And you can never have mine. Tell me, my father and I will have divergent uh, temperament. He might forgive you, but I will never forgive you for coming between our only sister and the whole entire family. You better start leaving before Dad finds out you're still in the palace. No problem. Have a nice day. Honey, what do we do? Do we make a formal report to the police at this point? But what must have happened to her? Whatever that happened must be from that boy. I warned him to stay away from my daughter, but he refused. Now I will skin him alive if anything happens to my daughter. My love, he hasn't come to this at this point. No, it's not a time for this. Let us find Jane first. Then the other thing can follow. Could this be a kidnap or something? Why haven't they contacted us yet? Wait. Is it possible that Tiger and his boys are responsible for this? My father loves me. He loves me well, well. I say he came for me. He loved me well, well. Your daughter? Your Majesty, that's not our doing. We have no reason to abduct your daughter. Why should we? So, you do not know the whereabouts of my daughter. Your Majesty, I can swear with my life. I don't know her whereabouts. Your Majesty, we have no reason to go against any member of your family. We parted mutually with your son. Remember, you paid us handsomely. And everything has been forgotten. behind this. Your Majesty, we need to unravel this. And I can be of assistance if you want me to.
I told you guys to make her comfortable, didn't I? Yes, you did. But you see, she's very stubborn and we've tried making her to eat and... Until uh, now. I'll tie her now. Okay, boss. Fast about it. Oh, my goodness. Hey. Collins, you did this to me. Uh, I'm sorry. My boys, they are crazy. I told them to make you comfortable enough. <laughs> Do not play smart with me. Why did you adopt me? Adopt you? I did not. Why will I adopt the only woman I love? Hmm? Why will I adopt my angel? The only woman I love in this whole wide world. Why will I adopt her? I did not adopt you. I only, um, I brought you here for us to talk. For us to sit, fork, and iron things out. Because I tried doing that before, but it refused me the opportunity. What nonsense are you talking about? Uh, babe. I see no reason you're putting up with that present. Oh yes. It's not good for you. I don't want you to continue with him. I don't want him near you. Did you get it? You know how much I feel for you. Let go. You think my father will ever forgive you for doing this? His majesty. His majesty will understand. He will understand that I'm just trying to protect you. I love you. You disgust me. I know. Take your hands off me. You're driving me insane. Oh, yes. I want to go home. I want to go home. You're driving me insane. You know how much I love you. I want to go home. Leave that poor boy alone and we will be happy. No. Don't treat me well. I want to go home. Sir, how are you? Good, how are Please, let me go call it and I'll pretend that this never happened. Baby, I didn't go through this trouble to pretend that this never happened. Huh? So what exactly do you want from me? I told you that already. I want you to give me assurance. Assure me that you are going to end things with that roadside mechanic. Assure me that you are going to be my own forever. That's all I want from you. You have lived in America for quite a while now. And you must have been deceived with their movies where love comes through kidnapping. Well, I'm sorry to disappoint you, honey. It doesn't happen in this part of the world. Not around here. And certainly not with me. Jane, please. Please what? Collins, are you letting me go or not? Are you? Okay. 
I'll let you go. But I want you to have one thing in mind. If you keep on rejecting me because of that idiot, I cannot guarantee his safety. What? Give me louder, Kai. Okay. I don't want the king to know that you're here. He is so pissed right now. And I don't know what he might do in that state of mind. Have you heard from my daughter? No. Well, I've reported to the police. Oh, we do we have done the same thing. No news no yet. News. Until now. Hey. Yeah. Michael, huh? I've been meaning to ask you this. Do you have any idea of who might be behind this? Or does Jane have issue with anyone or something? No. No. She's not a troublesome person. I don't know. Hey, my love. Where have you been? What, what, what happened to you? I've been calling you. It hasn't been reachable. I had to go to the house. When I got there, I saw no one. I, I called Oluchi and she said you came here. What happened? I think I left my phone at home. What happened to you? What, what, what? I've been so worried about you. Where have you been? What happened? Like you care. My darling, I care so much about you. You don't. If you care about me so much, you wouldn't have allowed father to send me out of this house because I followed my heart. No. I can tell her I care so much about you. I missed you so much. Greetings, oh. my sister. Jen, let's talk inside. There's absolutely nothing to talk about, Father. Nothing. Michael, let's go. Jen, I said let's talk inside. Don't let me repeat myself. For, for medicine and then you went ahead and chose science subjects in secondary school. I recall those days each time I came back from work you would rush to me. You would rush to daddy and Give me an almost professional massage. And you would call your mother and say, get paracetamol for daddy. I miss those years, my daughter. Then, then, 
for your culinary prowess. You, you, you prepared delicious dishes, especially Isiewu. Your Isiewu was so delicious, so tasty that, oh, he sent me back, back to the years with my mother when she prepared those dishes exactly the way I wanted them. That's what you did, girl. And, and I saw that you were my mother's reincarnation. And Joe, uh, I lavished love on you. Even when your siblings envied you, I loved you the more. Mm -hmm. I wanted the best, the best for my angel. The day you were born was the same day the community gathered together and made me their king. And the next day, the next day, my goods that were seized by customs and kept in their store for several years, for many years, were suddenly released. Angel, you brought luck to this man. You're a child that came with luck, with fortune, with wealth. That's why when you chose to study medicine, I said, yes, I will train you to the highest point of your education. Jane. Father. What happened to those dreams? Those lofty dreams? Nothing. I mean, nothing happened to any of my dreams, Father. I just stepped into my finals, and you know about that already. So, what are you really talking about, Father? Did you know that you were at the critical point of your education when you went and got engaged to that young man? How would you concentrate on your studies? How? Father, it's in no way affecting my studies. I'm still very focused. Hmm. Yeah. It's already affecting it. Jane, everything you worked for this six years, everything is going down the drain because of this young man. No, Father. Father, that's not true. I mean, you are the one dragging this. You are the one making a mountain out of a molehill, father. I mean, yes, I got engaged to Michael. But that doesn't necessarily mean that we're getting married today or tomorrow. Jen, I think you're talking about a dash. I am your father. I know these things. Jen, what I see as your father setting, you cannot see even when you climb the highest mountain, Everest. You can't see it. Then I want you to disengage from this young man, terminate your relationship, return home and face your studies. I'm, I'm sorry, Dad. 
relationship with this young man now. It's to really be hard, Father. I'm sorry if I'm disappointing you, but I can't. I can't. No, no, look me in the face. Tell me you can't. Go ahead. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Father. I'm sorry. I can't. Leave me. Was a loving father, all the love and care you gave me. What happened to you? What happened to you? My offense is asking to be with the one I love. Then you turn your back on me. What happened to you? What happened to you? Papa, what happened to the care that you showed me and the love that you... Hey! Where are you going with your luggage? Mom, I'm tired. I am leaving this house for good. I'm leaving. It hasn't gotten to this. We can still sort it out, all right? Take your luggage inside, I no, beg you. Mommy, I am not taking my luggage inside. I am leaving. Let, 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 let's not drag it, I beg you. Just take it inside, my daughter, for my sake. Please. Thought they said you were missing. And where are you going with your bag? Jim, please. Can Mom, I, okay, do I carry it inside? For I you? am leaving this palace. I am. No, no, no. Jim, Jim, excuse me. Jim, excuse me. Jim. Can I excuse me? What happened to you? What happened to you? My offense is asking to be with the one I love. Then you turn your back on me. What happened to you? What happened to you? Papa, what happened to the care that you showed me? And the love that we showed. You know, Lola. Yeah, you go now. You won't evaporate from the copper. What's the meaning of this rubbish? Get out of my sight. Get out! Get out! Wait, wait! Get out! Get out! Now we can push you. Do this. It feels like I am getting drowned. You are once a loving father All the love and care you gave me What happened to you? What happened to you? My offense is asking to be with the one I love Then you turn your back on me What happened? What? Collins kidnapped you? Yes, he did but please, do not make a fuse about it. What are you talking about? He didn't harm me. So? So if he didn't harm me, I should just let it go? No way! I, I never said you should do that, but you have to calm down. I resolved not to tell you about this, but since I've already told you, I don't want you to make trouble with him, what please. Are, what are you talking about? I should just let it go? If I do that, he'll do something worse tomorrow. No, he wouldn't. I mean, since he has already dawned on him that he will never get what he wants from me. He will never. Please. And what does he even want? crazy. The fool actually kidnapped me because he said I haven't been giving him a listening ear. So he wanted to persuade me to leave you for him. To leave me? Yes. It's a psycho. It's crazy. It's a psycho. I'm telling you. Pathetic swine. I don't even know how you got involved with such a man in the first place. It's okay. Please. Uh, uh, just listen to me. Okay. Okay, let's just move forward. Just because of you, I'll let it go. I also hope you're right by saying he won't do it again. No, he won't. I'm telling you he won't. Sorry. Okay. Let's just plan for something better. 
Our major problem right now is your father. Yeah. How do we convince him to see things our way? It's my father. I don't know. I don't even know. Maybe we should go for plan B. Plan B? Yeah. What's plan B? Your Majesty, you have to take it easy with the children of this generation. Do they even listen to advice? <laughs> My name. Do I even know what to do again? Huh? Am I going to call, call out the army to enforce whatever I want? I've exhausted myself. Look at it. A daughter I sent to school. Medical school for that matter. Training her, paying for her school fees. I'm even waiting for her to finish so that she will be flown to the UK to do a specialist course. I was waiting for her to finish and come back to set up a hospital. I've already mapped out the area. Mapped out the place I will set up the specialist hospital for her. Nenim Lemutu Psycho. Look at me. Look at specialist hospital. Your Majesty. You are lucky yours is from this region. Mine got hooked up with someone as far, far, far as the north. And all I did fell on deaf ears. I almost killed her if not for her mother. Today she has two kids for her so-called lover. And I have forgotten all about her. Your Majesty, what I am trying to say is uh, if you have done your best, and nothing seems to work. You just have to let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Jane in such situation. What, what, what are you talking about? Huh? What are you talking about? Hey, shut up and do not play smart with me. I did warn Jane about you, but I did not know the spell you used on her. Now she's doomed. She's into a situation and she does not even have anyone to run to. Do you know the situation you put her into? Huh? What situation? Did she tell you to speak for her? Did she run to you for help? What the? Don't you even have to? Shut up! Hey! Sorry, sorry, sorry. Shut up. Sorry, sorry. Please. Shut up. Sorry. She has not got into this. Now go down. Yeah, sorry. 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 I told you. I want you, right? I want you, right? She has not got into this. Huh? I will blow up your head now. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. 